Okay, so hello everyone. Today I'm going to teach you on how to connect your V8 sound card to your laptop and of course how to utilize the V8 sound card and the BM800 microphone condenser while using the open broadcast system. So let us proceed with our video for today. <laughs> Okay, so bago natin i-connect yung V8 sound card to your laptop, kakailanganin muna natin i-set up yung V8 sound card. So ito yung mga kakailanganin natin. Of course, kakailanganin natin ng uh, B, uh, BM800 microphone condenser uh, jack. Of course, kakailanganin natin yan. And dalawang cable lang ang kakailanganin natin para i-connect yung V8 sound card natin dun sa laptop. So, the first one is your earphone, uh, 3.5 earphone jack to your mini USB. So, ito yung gagamitin natin is yung mini USB lalagay natin sa my live feature ng V8 sound card. Live 1 or live 2. Bahala kayo. Okay lang. And yung earphone jack naman natin ilalagay natin dun sa earphone slot ng laptop natin. Next is your charging cable. Okay. Yung cable ng charger ng uh, V8 sound card natin. So, double purpose kasi ito. Uh, nagcha-charge ka na at the same time kinoconnect pa niya yung V8 sound card natin dun sa laptop natin so kapag kinonnect mo to mag notify or madedetect ng laptop yung V8 sound card katulad nga lang ng ginagamit nating mga charging cable kapag ginag sinasalpak natin yung cellphone natin dun sa laptop madedetect din niya so that is the same as when you are connecting your V8 sound card to your laptop. So, charging cable siya. Hindi niya na kailangan ng auxiliary. So, uh, set up muna natin to. So, unahin na natin yung 3.5 earphone jack to your mini USB. Of course, katulad na sabi ko kanina, ilalagay natin doon sa may live 1 or live 2. Bahala kayo kung saan nyo gusto. Next is itong US, uh, yung charging cable niya. Of course, lagay natin sa may charging. And, wag natin kakalimutan yung BM800 condenser microphone jack. And of course, meron din, meron din tayong nakakalimutan which is your earphones. Okay? Yung earphones natin, pwedeng normal earphone lang na merong isa lang na earphone jack. Pero kung yung earphone nyo is ganto yung pang gaming earphone na merong green and red, okay, medyo tagilid tayo dyan. Especially kapag wala kayong splitter or yung conversion line na tinatawag. So, kapag ganda yung headset nyo, bumili muna kayo ng splitter na i-coconnect natin, lalagay natin doon sa may V8 sound card. Kasi hindi to gagana, hindi to makakadetect ng any sound or any output coming from the recording. So, kakailanganin nyo muna ng splitter. Sa akin, hindi pa dumadating yung order ko na splitter. So, hindi ko muna gagamitin yung headset ko. Yung normal headset lang muna ang gagawin natin. So, since they set up na natin to, they set up na natin, ilalagay na natin to dun sa may USB port ng laptop at dun sa earphone slot ng laptop. So, para ano na, para makita nyo na yung panong iset up yung B8, B8 sound card dun sa laptop, mag-change na tayo ng camera, magre-record na tayo dun sa laptop. Okay, so kung napapansin nyo, nandito na tayo sa may uh, OBS or the Open Broadcast System at ang gamit ko is the default microphone. Okay lang naman kung yung default microphone ang gamitin ninyo pero mawawala na yung purpose ng video natin. So, uh, i-coconnect na natin yung, uh, na natin yung uh, V8 sound card sa laptop. So, unahin na natin, wait lang, unahin na natin yung um, cable na pang charge ng V8 sound card, lalagay natin sa USB port ng laptop. Okay, kahit sa ang USB port, okay lang yan, basta meron siya lalagyan. Next is itong earphone jack natin. So, the earphone jack, yung earphone jack ng, uh, ng uh, V8 sound card natin is lalagay natin sa may earphone slot ng laptop. Okay. So, dito sa may earphone slot ng laptop, nalagay ko na. And then, after that, merong magpa-pop up dyan. So, dito sa nag-pop up, piliin lang natin yung line in. Ibig sabihin, merong linyang papasok dito sa may laptop natin. So, okay lang natin yan. And then, ang susunod na gagawin natin is, of course, hindi pa kasi naka, la, hindi pa kasi naka-on yung V8 sound card ko. So, kung mapapansin nyo, nag 
nakakonek lang siya sa laptop, pero i-on na natin. Okay, i-on ka na. So, ayan, nag-on na siya. So, ang susunod na gagawin natin is to create another scene. So, meron na akong bagong scene dito sa may OBS para at least magamit natin yung V8 sound card natin. Kasi kapag dito natin nilagay, hindi maririnig yung V8 sound card or yung oh, paggamit ng V8 sound card kasi meron na tayong default microphone. So, gagawa tayo, mag a tayo ng another resource ng audio input capture. Okay, so, let's go! Okay, so ayan, na na natin yung uh, V8 sound card natin. Pero yung output nito is medyo mahina. So, kailangan nating dagdagan yung decibels para mas maganda yung output ng uh, sound card natin. Lagay lang natin ng 10 decibels. Okay, so okay na yan. So, para ma-decipher natin or ma-differentiate natin kung ginagamit na ba natin to, of course, on nyo lang yung echo. Hello! Okay, so meron na tayong echo. So, ginagamit na natin yung V8 sound card natin. So, okay na. Yun na yung connection. Ah, yun na yung uh, how we are going to connect the V8 sound card to our laptop. Okay. So, just a simple tip from me. If ever man lang cover kayo ng kanta, kasi usually yun yung ginagamit, uh, yun yung panggamit ng V8 sound card and BM800, katulad ko, ginagamit ko, uh, yung treble natin, lagay nyo lang sa maximum. Base natin, 60 to 80 percent. Record, music, as well as the monitor, okay lang na maximum nyo sila. And if ever man lang na four classes, yung, gina, yung, yung uh, panggamit nyo ng V8 sound card at yung BM800 condenser microphone natin, of course, babaan natin yung uh, echo. Kung gusto nyo na merong echo, okay lang. Lagyan nyo ng uh, echo, pero dapat naka-MC mode tayo para at least mas firm mas buo yung boses na produce ng V8 sound card na pupunta doon sa rinirecord natin. And since gamit na natin yung V8 sound card, pwede mo, din, pwede mo na din siyang ano, uh, gamitan ng mga buttons like yung, yung cheer natin. O, oh, diba? O, oh, diba? So, pwede mo na siyang gamitin. Marami pa din like the embarrass. Ano ba? Ayan, embarrass. Or yung laugh. Okay, so pwede mo na silang gamitin. So, that's it. Ganun lang kasimple mag-set up ng V8 sound card and BM800 condenser microphone na gagamitin sa OBS. Hopefully na nakatulong ako sa inyo. And if you have any other questions or queries, I am willing to answer them as long as I can answer them. And you can just hit me in the comment box below. So, that's it. And thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like the video, and hit the notification bell for more upcoming videos that I will do. Hopefully, magkakaroon na ka ng cover, cover uh, on uh, different songs. Hopefully lang din naman. Pero I will find time for that. So, goodbye everyone. Thank you for watching. See you again in my next video. Goodbye.